times a hundred bands. Can you get it? Ain't no running man. Keep a hundred rounds. We gon' get them, ain't it? Hey guys, what's up? It's Tati and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what is in Baby Boy's hospital bag. So far, he's the only one that's packed and ready to go. So I'm proud that I've even packed his bag because I haven't been really doing much lately. I'm currently 37 weeks pregnant. So we're almost there if baby boy goes full term. I have about three weeks left, but hopefully he comes before then because I am absolutely exhausted. But I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I have in his bag now. This is the diaper bag that I have. It's by Hap Brand. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, I'm gonna leave it linked down below if you guys wanna check them out. They have really pretty colors. Um, yeah, but this is her in her full glory um she also has this little side bag thingy here this little side strap i like side bags better than backpacks anyway so that's really exciting um and then my boy oh my gosh i'm calling my boyfriend i'm literally married my fiance um also got the little portable changing pad they just put in the back here and then she has this little puff the puff comes in i think like four different colors so you can kind of mix and match um we have this little braided side compartment here and on the other side as well for bottles and then we have two inside compartments as well we have this little pouch in the front that I'm probably just going to use for like my wallet and my phone and that's really it. Um, but yeah, she's super roomy. Um, we also bought these little pouches for extra like organization and stuff. But she's really roomy and she's not heavy at all. And she's absolutely stunning. I don't want to tell you guys the price of this bag. Um, because obviously you can find way cheaper ones but this was just a vibe and I really wanted her so my boo made it happen so we're just gonna jump right in and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm packing for baby boy this is my first child my one and only and if I overpacked I mean it is what it is I'll update you guys and tell you what I ended up using and what I didn't use um, and if I underpacked, any moms out there, go ahead and let me know things that you packed and found helpful. Because like I said, this is my first baby and I really don't know what to pack for him, but I think I did a pretty good job. So let's jump into it. So opening the bag, right in this first little compartment, I just have like wipes. I have a pack of these Munchkin pacifier wipes. Um just in case i don't even know if my son will take a pacifier but i'm packing it just in case and then i have a pack of these hand and face wipes um mainly because like no shade no tea i don't know who's gonna be visiting me in the hospital but i hope they touch his face or like i don't know i like barely want anyone touching him really oh my pouch okay so in this first little pouch here we have a couple of pacifiers so i have this one here which is more like silicone -y. Um, my cousin did recommend these because babies tend to like this one more it doesn't have like any backing and it's really like close to feeling like a nipple so they tend to like these better um but just in case and if not I also packed him one of these Dr. Brown pacifiers. These come in packs of two. Um, and then it's just on this little Cookie Monster clip that I that my aunt got me for my baby shower. And don't worry if I'm like rubbing all up on them because they still need to be sterilized. I just kind of threw them in for show, but I'm gonna sterilize those. Um, and this second pouch we have 
this little pair of mittens. Everything in here, like clothing and sock wise, is from Carter's, just in case. Um, so I have this little pair of white mittens with gray triangles. And you'll see his clothes are like neutral colors, so these kind of match all that we packed. Then I have one of his beanies, and I did order him a custom white beanie with his name that should be arriving soon. I'll probably like insert a clip in my next video if you guys want to see what it looks like. Um, but yeah, we just have this gray little beanie with ears from Carter's as well. And then I have three pairs of newborn socks. I'm not going to show you guys all of them because they're just socks. But they're just um, white and baby blue. One has stripes and one has like polka dots. But yeah, I wanted them in a separate bag because trying to like change him and find like all his little socks and stuff I'm sure is going to drive me insane. So... I have them in a separate pouch the next thing I have in like these back compartments here is a pack of these honest wipes um, I know the hospital I'm sure the hospital is gonna have like wipes and diapers and stuff like that but when I think hospital supplies I think of like really rough things so just in case I don't like them or for whatever reason I just feel comfortable using my own I am going to be prepared so I just have these packed back here Sorry guys the camera was dying but yeah I showed you guys the wipes right next to them I just packed these little newborn diapers that are also by Honest um, I just packed like a handful because again I know they're gonna have diapers but we're gonna see because I might not be messing with those diapers but who knows okay so getting to like his main stuff we packed about three outfits which might be too much or might not i don't know we packed them three outfits he has a going home outfit for sure i know he lives in um like the little hospital ones when he's born and you can't really change him or whatever but just in case i want to switch him in between um we have a couple of things for him so i'm gonna just start with like his basic stuff so his bottoms are just these itty bitty gray little sweatpants um they do like cuff at the end so they're super cute and these are by carter's as well these are in the size newborn they're super stretchy though um which is good because obviously not all babies fit into newborn but i think he should be fine then to go with his little joggers we have just this plain white onesie that has some cloud stars moon and the sun and i just think this is such a cute little fit like it's so cute um and then we have another plain onesie this is for him to just like chill in again from Carter's this was in a pack of like four or five I think or no just one made by Carter's I think I got it at Carter's or Walmart anyway I think Carter's it comes in like a little pack of five but it's just a little short sleeve baby blue onesie that could also go with his joggers as well if we wanted to but he might just chill in this one and his actual going home fit is iconic um so we just have these fleece we just have these fleece little sweatpants that again are more fitted at the bottom what oh, she's looking for somewhere to lay down yeah where you doing come here fox <laughs> that come was here. my dog sorry come here Okay, so we just have these little fleece sweatpants that are fitted at the bottom. And they have a little bare face on the butt with little ears. Um, very skims, you know, like her little like pajama collection or whatever. That 
with just a little white short sleeve onesie and then he has this newborn um hoodie newborn hoodie that i got it was like a little set from carter's it has ears and it's just it's gonna be an all white fit because you know he's a little angel but even like this little fit would be cute too so that's what we're packing and see how like his colors are really neutral so that's why i packed like the white mittens a gray beanie and his beanie that's coming with white um but that's it for clothing like i don't think it was too much i know people who pack like one outfit and they're just done and whatever but this is my first child so let me pack a couple fits you know then i have just a little burp cloth um i got this in a pack of like three or four i don't know where they're from cloud island i think it's a target brand um i got it for my baby shower but i'm packing a burp cloth because i know you burp them after you feed them and obviously i'm going to be breastfeeding so i figure like you burp them but i'm just packing one and then i'll probably use like a hospital swaddle to like let them burp on it or whatever then i do have this little swaddle here it smells so good because we washed all his stuff but this was again in a pack of i want to say three or four and i got it at carter's um but yeah just a swaddle blanket i know the hospital is gonna have like the hospital swaddle but i'm probably gonna pack like a velcro one too because i'm a new mom and i don't really know how to swaddle i know i'll learn but just in case um we have that and then the last thing that i'm packing is his blanket he has so many different blankets but we decided to just take this super soft gray one um it's super super soft and it smells really good it smells like all of his stuff so we're just gonna take this for like the car ride and the stroller ride to the car um but yeah so we have that as well i'm thinking i don't think that i'm missing anything again if you are a mom and this is not your first rodeo please let me know what you guys packed in your bag in case i am missing anything but yeah guys that is what i have packed in baby boy's hospital bag like i said he's the only one who's packed so far i'm gonna try and pack my bag by friday so i can film it over the weekend for you guys and have a little update it's gonna feel so good to have all of our bags packed and ready so i know in my mind that we are as prepared as we can be um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope it was helpful like i said i'm a new mom so if you're a new mom too don't worry we're gonna figure this stuff out but just pack the things that you think that you're gonna need for your baby and don't take these videos as like 100% things that you need to pack for your experience and your baby. Whatever. Pack what you want. Pack what you think you need and we'll figure it out together. But I'll see you guys next time in my next video. Um, if you haven't checked out my previous video, it is an updated nursery video. Um, we're going to probably film the next one once his mattress arrives and we can have everything done. 100% so that should be the next one and I'll see you guys then. Bye!